I make it? I'm Wendy. And I'm not happy. <laughs> Lush haul and Wendy has a mini other haul that we're going to be linking down yeah. below. They're going to be going up close, maybe on the same day. Oh, haven't really planned this whole thing out, but we each have mini hauls that we completed separately. And I was like, why not film them? We don't have to do everything together. Get out of my video. <laughs> in Las Vegas last weekend and Ooh. it was the day before Mother's Day and because we know a party in Las Vegas we went to the mall. <laughs> it was pouring down rain. Did you gamble at all? We didn't. What? But it was kind of, we're going back next month. Okay. So I am kind of saving up I think. Okay. Anyway, it was just a kind of very chill weekend. So it's pouring down rain, we go to the mall and there's a lush and you know, Lush isn't in a ton of our malls down here. Like, mm -hmm. I have to go out of my way to find one. So whenever I see one, I have to go in. And my husband walks in and he turns around and he's like, I can't handle it. He's like, buy whatever you want and walks out. And so I was like, hello, buy whatever. It's the deal for Mother's Day. Okay, why couldn't he handle it? The, the, the smell. smell of it. it doesn't like really strong smelling things. Yeah. So he just turned around and walked out. And then it was even more lovely because five minutes later he walked in with this like giant fancy lemonade from this place, handed it to me and walked out. I'm like, this is the best day ever. Wow. Just bring me drinks and I'm shopping and it was lovely. That so sounds nice. I picked up a few things for myself for Mother's Day and I have to look at the names while I do this because because I don't remember them. They've got all these fancy crazy names. So the first thing I got, I ha I got three bubble bars. Do I have the name of this one? Oh, See, I need you to talk me through this a little bit because I've been into the Lush store, but I've yes. never purchased anything for myself. <gasps> so, especially when it comes to these things, like, do you put that whole thing? Wait, it goes in your bath. So this is a bubble bar. This is the Big Bang bubble bar, and I must have been in a particular mood because all of this stuff smells kind of similar. It all has kind of a candy sweet oh, scent. Uh huh. And um, this is a bubble bar. Now I am very Lush frugal, so I don't ever t put a whole anything on my bath. Bubble bars are meant to be crumbled under the bath water. So oh, you okay. can break off a piece, crumble it under your bath water, it produces big fun bubbles, smells delicious, it's wonderful. And I can get at least four uses out of one of these, if not more. I don't need like the whole thing overflowing with bubbles and I wanna make it last. Yeah, I don't blame you. Because it was probably like $10, right? Yeah, these are between like six and nine dollars for these yeah, things. Ooh, so I that. try and get several uses out of them. So I don't know if I have any information on what this smells like. Question. Yes. Does it turn your water that color? Sometimes they turn your water color, but not bright blue. They would just like Does it leave a tint on your skin? No, but some of them have oils in them, so it oh. doesn't leave a tint, but it leaves like a nice, like, you know, Sounds luxurious nice. feeling on your skin. So this has avocado butter, grapefruit oil, lemon myrtle oil. It really has a- It does smell like lemon and grapefruit. It's very sweet smelling. It's sweet, but fresh. Does have that like those citrusy undertones. Yeah. So I also have. Hey, you said it was called Big Bang. Theory. The, <laughs> the Big Bang Bubble Bar. Did you buy it because it's called? Because you. I truly did not know the names. I looked them up uh, okay. before we did the video. Um, I may have seen it there. They have so many. They have so many. So this is Granny Takes a Dip. No <laughs> idea why they call it that. This one smells like straight up candy. I don't think so. I think it smells like soap. It's not okay. It looks like a cinnamon roll, though, if you were to cut a cinnamon roll before you bake it. That you think? Yeah, it's, yes, <laughs> it, it is, and it, I, I don't it know, I don't have good. the actual notes of it, but it's sweet smelling, not overpowering. You know mm -hmm. I don't like super heavy sweet stuff. That one, the first one smells sweeter than that one does. Really? I think so. And then the last thing I have, this is also a bubble bar, and this is the creamy candy. This definitely smells like candy. Oh my goodness! Oh! Double bubble bubble gum. Yes, it does. Which I like Ooh. a lot. A lot. I also, for the first time, got a shampoo bar. This is the Montalbano shampoo bar, and this is for serious shine. Now, there was a different one that I wanted. I wanted the cinnamon one just because I like the way it smells. And she goes, uh -huh. Look, I would recommend this one because if you're highlights, it'll keep it from turning brassy. And I was yeah. like, well, I don't highlight my hair. You're like, this hair. is all natural, baby. She's like, well, <laughs> it is good for lighter color. It is a good clarifying shampoo. So, fine. I uh, used it last night. Hilarious. My hair felt 
amazing. Wait, you use that in your hair? Yes. Like you rub it on you your rub head? rub it on your head. Does it make it foamy like yes. shampoo? Yes. It gets really? sudsy. Yes. And then you just... Now this, I bought the tin for it to go in, otherwise it would just disintegrate yeah, in the shower. Totally. They sell a circular one that's technically for those, but they don't fit in there very well until they start to break down a little bit. So she recommended the square <gasps> one. Oh my goodness. What did you use for conditioner? Regular conditioner? Well, because I got that, she goes, let me hook you up with the conditioner. Well, hey, look at that transition. So this is the Veganese conditioner. Oh, Veganese, like mayonnaise. Um, I will oh, say oh, it smells so good. Yeah, this is right up Wendy's. Like, did you smell this? Yeah, because it's like lemon. Yeah, yeah. it's very lemon pledgy <laughs> scented. Um, I use these together. I was a little concerned about the conditioner because the conditioner does not leave your hair with that really conditioned, like slick, smooth. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when I went to comb it out after the shower and blow dry it, my hair felt fantastic and it felt like light and clean and soft. So, I am very happy. I, the conditioners are much more expensive than the shampoo bars. Is this a sample she gave you? Yeah. Oh, sweet. Which was nice. The last thing I bought was a total impulse purchase. This is the Mint <laughs> Julep. <laughs> is this where they have all of at the countertop? Yeah. Yeah. And, oh, <laughs> this is not our day! <laughs> I caught it in midair and poured it at the ground because this is glass. <laughs> <laughs> the guy was talking to someone else about it and I just kind of got... Jealous, right? So is that lip scrub? Yes. Oh, awesome. They had three flavors, and I love mint, so I bought it. I threw it in with my stuff because I wanted a lip scrub because my lips are feeling like they need some scrubbing. But I got home. It was twenty eight dollars. No. Somebody's use it or it's dry. Neither. Smell it. Uh oh. Return it. It's cocoa. It's, it's chocolate. Mint chocolate oh no 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 which it, it says back somewhere like it's just it says mint juleps mint julep is a drink that is, is mint. mint but then if you look here it says tasty mint chocolate sugar lip scrub now mint juleps is a terrible name for a mint yeah. chocolate they lips in there i get it oh uh, but i was so disappointed because i like mint i like chocolate mint i don't like chocolate scented products that are not meant for eating see if you can return it I'm not going to return it. I I'd be like, I'm it. allergic it to chocolate. It's my own dumb fault. It's written on there. It's I was it. just like impulse buying. Yeah. Now, it works. I've used it a couple times. I just have to, I have to use it in the shower so I can immediately rinse it off. I was like scrubbing it and I'm like, don't breathe. I, I don't hate don't breathe. this. And I you're so bad. You're <laughs> supposed to, it's like lick off the excess. Ew. No. No, I keep my mouth closed tightly, scrub it, rinse, it does not go anywhere near anything, it's, but it works. And it has kind of that like, you know, like oily, yeah. I'm sure your lips felt nice, even though you hated every minute of it. I did hate every minute of it. <laughs> so that is my latest Lush haul. I love it there. If you like these Lush hauls, if you like these mini hauls, if you like us, give this video a thumbs up. If you're new to our channel, click that subscribe button and we'll see you in another video very soon. Bye. Bye.